Well, good afternoon and welcome to Ohio and Windy Hill Kennel. This is Anna's kids. These are all phantom puppies. Every one of them is a black phantom and they are all sold. They are super cute. They are just really um, starting to come into their own. They are happy and bouncy and they play. They're in the house with us. They're totally weaned now. Anna had finally had it with them. She says, like, I'm ready to be done with these people. So they are in the house with us learning some basic behaviors. We're doing no bark, no bite, no lick. And so far they're doing really good. They uh, love their box because we put a big cardboard box in there and we teach them that that becomes their security blanket. And they're going to scatter all over this pen. I should have made it a little bit smaller, but I didn't. That's the neon pink collar. The light pink is over there to the left, right there. And there is the yellow collar, and that is the red collar. So Vanessa did weights for me before she just took off. So let me find my paper that she did these on, and I will give you their current weights. That one says I gotta go potty. All right, so this is not gonna be easy. As big as this pin is to keep them in the view, all right, so let's start. The yellow collar, which is right there playing with the blue ball, is three pounds, three ounces. The light pink collar, which is right there. This is the light pink collar. There you can see that collar. She is three pounds, 10 ounces. The neon pink collar, which is over here. She's on the left, trying to take the squeaky toy away. Oh, nope, she missed it. She's trying. The neon pink is three pounds, three ounces. And the red collar who won the toy is three pounds, 5.5. They are all really, really, really just about the same. Um, they're almost like little Bobsy twins out there. They're all doing really good. They're eating dry dog food. They're getting a weekly bath. They're getting their toenails trimmed every week. And uh, we've scooped the faces, oh golly, probably four times since they've been little. And uh, tomorrow is bath day, so they're gonna get a bath. They're going to get their faces retrimmed, probably a hygiene clip. And, uh, oh, there it's funny. Probably get their ears plucked tomorrow. So when you pick your puppy up, it will have a fresh bath before it leaves, usually either that morning or the night before, but we try the morning that they're gonna go home. And um, ears will be plucked, the bottom of their feet will be shaved, and they'll have a hygiene clip. So they'll be ready to rock and roll. That's funny. They've all picked a different toy and they've all keep playing to keep away. What are you doing? That's the pink collar one that's running back there. I love them at this age. They're so cute. They, they bounce around like little toys and they interact really well with each other. There's not a whole hoots bit of a difference between any of these guys' personalities. They're all just bubbly, outgoing. They're very affectionate. They're a great schnoodle. I love schnoodles because of that personality and you can't beat it, that's for sure. We've been trying to introduce them to different toys. They love, they love rattle toys. They like uh, squeaky toys. That one's trying to make the pink one squeak and hasn't accomplished it yet. I think that's actually the neon pink collar. No, it's the red collar that's got the pink toy. And the neon pink one has the blue toy back there with the zebra. And they prefer squeaky toys over stuffed toys. Uh, they've gotten to where they don't pay attention too much to their stuffed toys. They like things that they can pick up, chew on, um, that they can get some movement back on. And a lot of their toys are baby toys. That blue and yellow ball right there that that one's after is a rattle toy. It's a baby toy with a ball inside that rattles. And sometimes I can find stuffed toys that rattle when you pick them up or they drag them across the floor and they will make it rattle. That yellow one out there rattles when they move it. So that's kind of what seems to intrigue them is things that make noise.
I love the, being quiet, listening to the birds. I don't know if it's going to come across the video or not, but the woodpeckers have been out like crazy, and the birds have been going crazy around here lately, but they're all nesting, and we're fighting the birds that are all trying to nest where they shouldn't want to nest. These guys are all climbing in the pile in the back over a toy. That pink toy seems to be it today, that and the blue one. They can get their teeth through that blue one pretty easy. It's also a baby toy. I think I got it at Walmart. It says, I, oh, the pink, little neon pink collar puppy's going to try and take it away. What are you doing? I see you. You're looking at my feet. Can you look up? Hey, psst, 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 psst. Look up here. There you go. Yeah, look up. There you go. She says, what are you looking at? They're funny. What one doesn't get into, the other ones will. That's for sure. The yellow collar puppy's got this pink toy now. He must have took it away from... And when I say he or she, please don't call me and say, it was supposed to be a girl. If it doesn't have a pink girl collar on, <laughs> it's a he to me. <laughs> All right, we're going to argue. She says, do you like that look? She turned around and gave him that look. He listened. He left her alone. If you have not booked in with me to come pick up your puppy, please text me or call me. And that way we can get you guys on the calendar. Uh, some of my days filled up pretty quickly. Um, but I'm trying to give everybody at least a half an hour between people so we don't have anybody here on top of each other. And uh, we haven't had that happen yet. We were close, about three minutes apart once when the other people pulled out. We, I think it was about three minutes the second one pulled in. So uh, just let me know if you have not and we'll get you on the calendar. And that way we can keep social distancing. These guys will go home with their collars on. I have never had a leash on them yet. So if you're going to bring a leash, uh, I would bring a retractable. So if you stop, um, and you should have all gotten your videos. If you have not gotten your videos, please text me and tell me I did not get my videos. Uh, I sent out uh, two emails, one that had a whole group of videos on it for you to listen to before you come. The other one had your new vet vitamin information on it. So if you did not receive those, please call me uh, or text me and I will get those.